Hi everyone, this is Silence Remover. It is a tool that will make your life easier if you are a YouTuber, filmmaker, shooting interviews, or anything like this situation. It is really that easy. Just lose a clip here, check your waveform, select your clip in the timeline, and apply it to sequence. And you are done. You got your edits. Okay, in normal situation, I shoot like video like this that have gaps of silence. Maybe I'm trying to take another time, like checking the script and going back. So what I usually do is like make a cut and lead this silence and go here and make another one and lead this one. So it's a very tedious mount fork. I'm sure if you ever edit a video, you know this headache. So <laughs> let me delete this nightmare from here and start again. Let's go to window, extensions, silence remover. Also, you can dock it like me here. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna get the same file here and drag it and go into the silence remover. Okay, it's gonna take like three, four seconds and it's gonna analyze the whole audio for silences. Let's see what kind of controllers we have. This one is the minimum silence time in millisecond. If it's 2000, it means two seconds, which means any silence under two seconds is not gonna be detected. The first one is the silence level. In case you have like uh, noise in your uh, audio or something like that, any audio under this level is gonna be treated as silence. Here we have the offset in millisecond. So by default, it's gonna be sharp cut before the audio. So just play with this one to get like a space before and after the audio. Once you check the whole audio and feel like this is the right cut for you, and also here you can get like uh, how many silence you got, and that's really it. Just highlight the clip and apply to sequence. And this one I'm gonna say in Arabic. Mabrook, you got your first cut. This is like eight minute clip and it's done in seven seconds. You can see that the silence in yellow, this is not just for coloring for fun or something like that, no. <laughs> if you selected any silence clip here on the timeline, you can right click it and go to label. And from here, select label group. And it's gonna select all the silences you have or the yellow silences you have. So you can just delete all. Now you are left with your clean takes. Just choose the right ones and you are done. The last option I want to show you here is the markers. So you can apply as markers and apply the sequence. This will give you the beginning and the end for every phase you are saying. Also, don't forget you can always shift your in and outs by using the offset option here. And in case you are wondering what is this pattern for, if you have a 4K file with a gigantic data in it, Something like this, even the quick time can't read immediately. So let's select the track and prepare audio. Choose where to save it. Automatically, Media Encoder will open and render MP3 file for you. After finish, you can drag the MP3 file instead of the original file. And yeah, I think this is everything. It is really, really easy to use, easy to work with. I hope you have fun with it. Thanks for watching and bye.